I'm Sam Katzen, Group Product Marketing Manager at Okta, and today I'll be joined by Anna Simmons, Senior Product Manager at Okta, to talk about user campaigns. Typically, organizations will use Okta Access certifications to create recurring campaigns for sensitive resources, helping to ensure that only the right people have access to these resources. But even with recurring reviews, organizational changes can open the door to over-provisioning. Perhaps the most common event is someone changing jobs in an organization. Their role changes, their responsibilities change, and so their access should change too. Too often though, the primary focus is on granting that mover access to new systems they need to do their job, with existing access not always looked at. This can lead to permission bloat. User campaigns can be automatically triggered by events in Okta like a role change, so security and IT teams can automate and scale access reviews right when role changes occur, maintaining least privilege and keeping an organization more secure. Anna, let's see how it works. Let's walk through an example of user campaigns adopted from a real customer. For this customer, there are over 200 department changes every week. And for each of these users that have changed departments, we want to have their new manager review the currently assigned access and determine if it's needed in their new role. I've already set this up as a weekly department change campaign. Let's see how it's configured. When I go into edit, I can see the general settings. It looks similar to what we've seen before. And I'm running this campaign every week. I run it for five business days and repeat it every week. Then I've defined the users that are in scope. So I could set specific individual users. This is especially helpful if you wanted to create and launch a campaign directly from an event that's happening and you know the users in scope. I could also use expression language to define based on, for example, an Okta user profile attribute. In this case, I have a specific group. It's the department change group. And that group I'm actually populating using Okta workflows. When a user profile has changed, and it's the department, I add them to this group. And then every week after this campaign launches, I empty the group and it's ready for the next week. That way, this campaign is set up, it runs every week, and I don't need to touch it. My Okta workflow is doing all the magic. Now I continue, and now I decide for those users what resources are in scope. In this case, I have all apps and groups assigned to the user selected. I could review just apps or just groups. And then I've set two other settings. Here, I'm only including individually assigned apps. That means applications assigned by groups will just have the group reviewed. That helps reduce some of the redundancy since removing from the group will also remove the app assignment. Additionally, I'm only including individually assigned groups. I have a high level of confidence in my group rules, and I know that when they've changed departments, we've re-evaluated re the group rules based on that new department, so I only want to look at those that are individually assigned. I can exclude specific apps or groups. In this case, I'm excluding that department change group that we're managing with Okta workflows. I could include others, for example, if there's low risk applications that all employees have, and I don't wanna bother the, the managers with that review, I can exclude them there as well. I'm gonna continue. I've got my manager assigned. I'm sending them notifications, and I have the same remediation options. So I'm gonna remove them from the resource if they, the reviewer revokes access or does not respond. Now my campaign is set up and I'm gonna click in and launch that campaign. Now, let's see what it looks like for one of our user's managers. Another day, another dollar, but at least I got somebody new joining the team this week, so it'll be pretty cool to onboard them. In fact, we got this email from Okta to view assigned reviews. Huh, so this is all of Isaac's access. Go take a look here. Okay, definitely still needs box. Cool. With event-driven user campaigns, we can automate the exact types of reviews that can help an organization maintain least privilege in a scalable way.